Hey, um, so before I start this video, I would like to make one thing very clear that this is all for educational purposes, and I really do suggest you get this game from Steam to support the developers, but if you do not get it from Steam, then this is a way you can get the mods to work on a cracked slash pirated version of the game. So this this is all for educational purposes. So let's get to the video. Alright, so to begin this video, we're going to just get the mods installed. So we're going to get the mod installer, the mod launcher, all that stuff. We're going to get that installed, and then after that, I'll teach you how to configure it to your pirated version. So the first thing you're going to do is go to Google Chrome or whatever your web browser is, and you're going to go to thunderstore.io. The link will be in the, the description. But you're going to just click Get App. Right? It's going to take you to Overwolf, which is just an app store for a bunch of um, game mods. And it should come up. You're going to click Download. Once the download's complete, you're going to click it. It's going to run it like a .exe, so it's going to... Yep, it's going to... It's loading. It should come up. It's going to ask if you want to make changes to your device. You're going to click Yes. So now you're going to just go through the installation, so you're going to just click next. Where do you want to install it? I do want to create a desktop shortcut. Maybe not one for Overwolf, but I will for Thunderstore. Um, I do not care about this. And boom, it's going to install, so I'm going to just let this install. And I'll be back when it's done. Now it's done. So, I'm going to just click launch. Now this is the Thunderstore manager, but I'm going to click launch here. Right? It's going to open up. Here it is. This is the Thunderstore Launcher, which is just a mod menu for a bunch of games. So it's got all a bunch of games here. But we don't need any of these games. Um, we just need Lethal Company. So if you're only playing Lethal Company, I suggest you favorite it. And I suggest you suggest set as default. So it's warming it up. It's getting it all ready. So here is all the things. So select profile. This is the only profile we have. You can make a new profile like this, and you can import a new profile like this. So import new through code or yeah, all that. So we're going to select profile. We're just doing the default one. And we're going to go to settings. We're going to go to look. Well, you, here, you can see all the mods. So this is all the mods you can download. So bigger lobbies on here and everything. But yeah, we'll do that in a second. So you're going to go to locations. And since we're in a pirated copy, we're going to go to change lethal company directory, right? And we're going to find the directory. So mine's in my downloads, but yours is, might be somewhere else. But here it is. I'll go here. I click this. And I click the .exe, since that's what it's looking for. Right? Um, so now that that's done, we're going to get the mods we want. So we're going to go get mods. We're going to get bigger lobby. Pretty much that's all I'm getting. And we'll get... We'll get, um, let's get the HD shaders, I think. HD shaders. HD lethal. Here, this is the other one I want. Okay. Um, so now that we have our mods, right, you cannot just launch it like this. You cannot launch it through vanilla. If you click this, it's not going to work. It's going to try on opening it through Steam since you don't have a Steam account. Or since you, or Sorry. Since you don't have it on Steam, it's not going to work. So what we're going to need to do, and this is where it gets a little bit complicated, but just follow along. All you're going to need to do is go to your file directory, right? You're going to go to where the game is, right here, right? You're going to create a shortcut of Lethal Company. You're going to name it. You can leave it the name this, but I suggest you name it something where you know it's the modded version. So I'm going to just name it modded, right? And now that you have that shortcut, you're going to go to your Lethal Company right here. You're going to go to Settings. You're going to go to Locations, sorry, not locations, you're going to go to all, you're going to go to launch parameters, set launch parameters right here, you're going to copy all of this, all of it, so right there, and you're going to just copy it, you're going to control C, copy it, and then you're going to go back to that folder where your shortcut is, you're going to go to it, you're going to go to the modded shortcut, you're going to right click, you're going to go to properties, 
and it should say target right here, right? So you're gonna go all the way to the left. So the end of the the end of the text. So you're gonna hold your arrow key and just hold it down. You can hear I'm clicking it. It's not going anymore. So you're gonna all you're gonna do is click space, one space, right? That's it. And then you're gonna click Control V. And now you copied it all to the target. So pretty much you're just saying, hey, when you click this shortcut, also open this file while you're at it. So it opens the modded version, right? So now that you did that, all you're gonna do is exit out of this. You cannot use this to launch it, right? These don't work launch. So you have to go here, accidentally with Microsoft Edge, and you're gonna double click modded, and it should open it up. Right, right here. Just let it load. So it's going to launch like a regular um, version. And then you'll notice when it's here, hold up, when it's done launching. This is my first time launching it on this thing, so it's going to take a while. So I'm going to launch on online. I'm just showing you that it works right now. It's only loading weird because it's a virtual machine, so just bear with it. All right, here. And then now you can see right there, it says mod right there. So that's how you know you're in a modded game. If you click host, you can go here and you can see all this. And you can make the lobby as big as you want or whatever. And yeah, pretty much that's it. Um, before I finish this, I would just want to let you know that you can only play with other people who have the modded version. So if they don't have this exact amount, like these exact mods, then it won't work. So they either have to have, they have to have the exact same mods, unless it's a client side mod like HD Lethal Company, which is a client side mod, but bigger lobbies is not a client side mod. So everyone needs to have that mod installed to play. And you can only play with other people who have the cracked version of the game. Um, and then while you're at it, while you're here, I suggest you make another shortcut just call Lethal Company. So then you can bring both of these onto your desktop if you want. And now if you launch this, oh, hold up, I dragged it out of EXE. Now that you dragged the shortcut. Now this one launched is the vanilla version and this one mo the modded version. So you can just do that. But yeah, it's that simple. And now you can play modded with your cracked friends on Lethal Company. All right, bye.